I always try my best, and I have this friend who, if she gets one answer wrong, she'll push herself and not, like, this, she'll not stop until she gets it right. So, like, that's, that's kind of where I got it from. For this movie, Unfamiliar Grounds, my daughters are members of the movie making throughout the Bay group, which meets monthly and gives um, challenges in a day, and then they offer director's challenges, and they also have producer's challenges where you put certain elements into the movie, so this was for a producer's challenge. So we took the elements and kind of had a writer write the story for us around that. Um, so I've done some challenges like that, like uh, the 48-hour 48, 48 film festival, uh, and they, they give you a line, a prop, and a character, and then you have to have those things in your movie, no matter what it is, and then they give you a genre. So it's, it's pretty tricky. But um, so most of my movies tend to be deconstruction of film genre or sometimes TV genre. And so um, it's, uh, it's sort of a little bit, a little more thinky. But uh, this movie was a straight up recording of something my daughter was performing. So she does uh, like scenarios and I would just film them. So this one cut together nicely. So that's why, I, that's where we got it from. <laughs> okay, we will be taking a small break until 2 p.m. My name is David, and I'm a petite reporter, and today we're here at the Nash National Kids Film Festival, and today I'm here with... Brian Doom. What are you, you doing here today? Uh, we were screening a film that I made with my daughter, and it's called Screamer. What inspired you to do this? Uh, well, this movie, uh, I have a lot of inspirations for each of my different movies, but this film was written by my daughter, who was 18 months old at the time, and she would enact little stories. And so sometimes I get them on, on tape or video or, or digital, and uh, this one just cut together really well, so I thought other people would like to see it, so we uh, share it with other people. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Uh, yes, yeah, so um, I've been making films since I was very young, and uh, started on 16mm and uh, doing clay animation, and nowadays uh, I shoot on digital video mostly, and I'm part of a, a film collective in San Francisco called Scary Cow. Where we can find you on social media? I don't really participate in social media so much anymore, um, but many of my films are at the Scary Cow Film Festival, and I'm still working on my first feature film, which is called I Work for Nemesis, and it's about spots. Thank you for your time. Bye. My name is Jade, and I'm a petite reporter today. I'm here with... Hi, I'm Victoria Kelman. What are you doing here today? Uh, I'm here for my film Moogle that I wrote an accident. What inspired you to do this? I guess it inspired me with uh, me and my friends. And, uh, I guess I, I hate boys, so I just wanted to make the best of it. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Uh, so I wrote that film and acted in it uh, about a year ago. And, uh, well, I'm 12 years old now, so... Uh, yeah, I just love doing acting. I've been doing it for six years. So. Where we can find you on social media? You can find me at um, Victoria Kalman Official on Instagram and Victoria Kalman on Facebook as a fan page. Thank you for your time. Bye. Hi, I'm Jade. I'm a reporter and I'm today there with. My name is Talia Saxon. I'm the lead actress of Polka Dots. What inspires you to do this? Well, I love acting, and I love crazy stuff, and Cynthia made a really crazy, weird, awesome film, and so um, I just was excited to be in it. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Um, yeah, I'm 13 years old. I did the film when I was 10, and um, I play volleyball, and yeah, I go to school. Where I can find you on social media? Um, I have an Instagram. It's Talia dot Satkin. And um, thank you for your time. Bye. My name is Jay. I'm with the Pete Recording. Today I'm here with 
Hello, I'm Howard Vidal, and was the Prodigy film, which you can see on Netflix. What inspired you to do this? Uh, my son was uh, into film, so it's really more my son's. Uh, uh, the initiative came from my son to do it. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Uh, yes, I'm uh, pretty much partially deaf, and so it's difficult to do things like this. But um, it's good to, good to see you guys out, and I think the kids uh, kids will enjoy us. Kids will enjoy our film too. Um, family friendly. And, uh, um, love to film. Thank you for your time. Bye.